Dear students, are you ready for the upcoming CBSC board examinations of class 10th and 12th? Well, there is still time and no need for panic when you choose to do things the right way. Here are 10 examination tips for you to help you significantly boost your grades in board exams. The first tip is read a small fraction of the entire syllabus. You don't have to read everything at one stress. Read a few chapters. It will certainly help you remember. If you rush through them, it will be difficult to recall. Don't stress the sessions beyond two hours. That is second tip. Do not study from dawn to dusk or for 10 or 12 hours. You need to follow certain processes. Like let your study time be composed of two hour slots. Divide these two hours further into four half hours. It goes like this. A 25 minute study plus five minute break equals to 30 minutes. Repeat the above 30 minute cycle four times for two hours. After this two hour study period, take a 20 minute break. Get ready for the next two hour study session. You may switch to a different subject. The third tip is take a quality break. Now that you have served your time for two hours, make sure you celebrate with a quality break. Do not use your off time thinking, calling, or messaging friends with study related matter. Give your mind a release. Whether you choose outdoor games, watching YouTube, listening to your favorite MP3 or podcasts, or munching your favorite cookie, it's entirely your choice. But let it be a quality break. The fourth tip is focus on the main points. The syllabus is made up of core materials and explanations. Core material consists of formula, diagrams, charts, and graphs. Explanations consist of examples and quotations. Study the core material since 70% 5% of the questions arise from here. Make sure you read the previous year's question papers. You may thus skim out the creamy stuff that is the important points. The fifth tip is switch subjects. Before you start, divide your subjects into categories. For example, Geography, biology, and history are memory intensive subjects. Physics, chemistry, and maths are logic based. English and languages are interpretation based. It's good to switch between these subject categories while studying for exams. But don't keep switching every time. Do it after a two hour long study of one particular subject. Now let's move on to the sixth uh, tip. Write it down. Read the chapter and underline the important points. Read these aloud while jotting them in your notepad. It helps retention when you hear it aloud and write. The seventh tip is use proper note-taking strategies. This is how you do it. Breeze through the textbook and underline the important points. It should not take you more than 10 minutes. Convert every heading and subheading into potential questions to be asked in the exam. Read the text again. Now write down the underlined points in your own words. Read aloud these bulleted points for better understanding. Ask yourself the questions you noted down by converting subheadings. See if you can answer them. Repeat these steps till you completely understand the lesson. Eighth tip is use visuals. Get yourself another miniature notepad or sticky notes. Now check the points you have previously underlined in the text or notepad. Convert these points into visual cues for better comprehension. For example, you can have a sticky note containing all the formula in physics. If you are studying chemistry, you can have periodic table elements 
depicted in a sequence as per their appearance in the reaction. Post these stick notes containing visual cues on your walls, cupboards, or anywhere in the bed or any particular convenient place in your room. The ninth tip is revise daily. Brush up whatever you study every 24 hours. According to science, 75% of what you just learned will vanish from memory if you don't revise. So make sure you revise and engrave the information in your mind. And the tenth tip is a good night's sleep enhances memory. Getting at least seven to eight hours sleep is a must. A good night's sleep helps convert short term into long term memory. Get yourself the sleep you deserve after all the efforts you have put in. So dear students, the above tips will certainly help you comprehend your lessons better and study faster. So leave aside all your anxiety and get down to the actual work. All the very best for your upcoming board exams. Thanks for watching.